Talks. I'm Nita. And I'm Judy. We're from Mandeville, Louisiana, and we're seeking $150,000 for 10% of our company, The Better Better. Okay, that's not bad. It's hard to find sheets that fit your mattress perfectly. They're either way too baggy or they're too tight, and the fitted sheet pops off of the corner of the... I know that pain. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, I've never had this happen before. Oh, man, yeah. They, they always seem to, like, it's too big, too small... Uh, it, it's too, it's a little too tight. So as soon as you start to like get into the bed and like move a little bit, it pulls and then boop, it's, it's coming, coming off. There you go. Mattress and putting on sheets is hard. Mattresses weigh a ton and they're too heavy for seniors or those with disabilities. So or, or even for me, my, I was, was going to say, right or even, even little people. <laughs> <laughs> I hate making the bed. <laughs> we told you that there's a product that solves these problems and a whole lot. It's the Better Better, the greatest bed making product ever invented. The Better Better is a giant headband that wraps around oh, the wow. sides of your mattress. You put it on oh, your that's why they're wearing those the terrible headbands. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why are they wearing those terrible headbands? This is not good for them. Now I get it. I bet you a producer told them they should do that. Probably. I would oh, say so. Nice. And putting on sheets is now. You would think they would at least put headbands on that match the colors of the clothes they're wearing. Is that a thing? I don't yeah. know if that's a thing. Or yeah, it is, but maybe it's to make it stand out so that we all sit here and go, why are they wearing those terrible headbands? It right. worked. It worked, Joe. Yes, you're right. You know what? Ding ding, it did, because you're right. If it matched, then I would just think it's part of their outfit. Exactly. Like Exactly. But we were like, all we were all thinking, yeah. why are they wearing them? And now so this is a great marketing you know, strategy because we were already asking the question. And as soon as they talked about this, we're all like, ah, that's why so automatically we've put two and two together in our heads yep 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 is that like a forced laugh or something i was gonna say that was like a ha -ha. <laughs> uh, this is awkward <laughs> this better yeah. be great <laughs> and there's no more tucking underneath the mattress you simply take the better better flip it down Put your fitted sheet in and flip the better, better back up. That's it. It's that easy. Nina, yeah. show them the top sheet. I will. Take the better, better, flip it down, put your top sheet oh, in. Oh, so now that, that right there. <laughs> Melissa would go crazy for that, my wife, because she always wants to tuck the top sheet under the bed. And it never, I mean, it stays for like one night, maybe, maybe two. But this, this would fix that problem. But yeah, but would it? If it's not going to stay under the bed, how is it going to stay in there? I'm skeptical. Mm, well, I guess we'll have to see. see how that I, I don't know. Is Robert there? No. See, Robert would jump right into the bed and be like rolling around in it, trying to like get it to <laughs> mess up. No, no, you didn't, because she has a better. Oh, look at Lori. <laughs> oh, look at that. Are your glasses? I don't know if I put my glasses wow. in there. So Who wants to join us and put a better better on every bed in the world? <laughs> and there is a better better in front of you. <laughs> How did you discover this idea? We can thank Judy's lazy son for this. He actually came home <laughs> from college and he started sleeping on a good couch. And she's like, why are you sleeping on my couch? She said, because the new bed you bought, the sheets are horrible. To, to make the bed every day, I'd just soon sleep on the couch. That seems pretty ungrateful to me. I don't know about you, Sam. <laughs> Well, yeah, I, I'd definitely take the bed over the couch. That's, but but just goes to show when someone's got a problem, they find a solution. They, they do a find a solution. Absolutely. And so um, she called me and said, "Hey, can you help me think of a way to make the bed easier?" And I know from working with Judy for 15 years that when she's on a mission, we're gonna figure something Judy's out. Judy's on a mission. Uh, <laughs> right. And within six months, we sold our first better better. Wow, that's ding ding. That's great for a turnaround time there. You know, six yeah, months. Yeah, totally. For 15 years, what yes. were you doing then? We have worked for um, 15 years in the insurance industry. I'm actually a lawyer by education, and I've been oh, wow. for a little while. And then I went and worked in the insurance industry. This is not a full time job. For you? It is. I am actually putting in my two weeks' notice, and I'm cashing out my 401k. So oh wow! Sometimes people's sheets, especially at the end, are longer. You're saying no matter the length, it easily tucks down in? Yes, yes, yes. Yep. that's the beauty of the Better Better. Any sheets from any store fit perfectly because you only have to tuck down about three 
So wait, I, before Kevin, sorry, just quick, crazy question. So you were skeptical, Sam, about whether or not this was valid, right? Uh, like, cause like, mm -hmm, why not mm -hmm. just tuck it under the bed? And, and the mm -hmm. reason you wouldn't tuck, you know, it doesn't work tucking it under the bed is cause you're not tucking it far enough where there's actual mm -hmm. weight being pressed down to hold the sheet into place. Mm. I mean, why. I can I can definitely see for people that have got beds that are sort of, you know, against the wall or they're tricky to get into, this would be so much easier because I know, you know, I've had kids that have had beds against the wall and you can't get the sheets under. I'm sceptical because I don't understand how one little headband thing can keep it in there. Mm. I, I don't know. Hopefully, I, I'm, I think I'm skeptical of the sales. Let's see what they got going for that for a $1.5 million valuation. Question on the bed. Yeah. Better. The, the issue is I'm always going to see a white band around the mattress. If I'm a fashionista and I'm, you know, designing a bedroom, I, I'm worried about the color. What if I don't want yeah, white? Yeah, I was going to ask the same thing. Yeah. Is it coming in colors? We do make it in colors, but white is our primary seller. We have sold a ton of these. We've only sold it for a little over a year and a half. Well, before we get to how many you sold, because that was obviously a blanket statement. Um, <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was terrible. How <laughs> <laughs> oh. do you sell it for? The average cost of goods sold is $33, and I mean $33.50. To make it or to sell it? To make it. It's made in the USA. $33? $33. Oh, wow. And the okay. sales price is $63.50. Okay. Okay, ladies, oh. I think there's an issue on production costs because yeah. that sounds mm, very Absolutely. Expensive. That's going to be very difficult for them to put it into any kind of, um, you know, retail anywhere. Uh, absolutely. At $33.50. That's super, super high. But, I mean, working with somebody like a Damon who, you know, works in textiles, maybe they could uh, get that down to, you know, $15 and then they could then they have some wiggle room to, to, to get there. Now, hopefully they have sales to support any of this. Absolutely. Yes. For, you know, basically a, a rim to a mattress. I'm going to tell you, this is a bad time. COVID came and so we it was hard to get material it's definitely hard to get elastic the material we use on the corner is more expensive and this is an industry that's completely new to us we didn't know how to go to china mm. or to order fabric we're normally in the insurance industry yeah but, yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah well i was going to say at least they've got their proof of concept Right, yeah. they've got their they've got their MVP, their minimum viable product. They know it works. They do have sales. I don't think we found out how many. We haven't found out their sales yet, have we? No, but but also I'm thinking because of COVID that no one's going to go jump into the bed and figure out if this is working or how yeah. like which kind of stinks. I could say your policy right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> in, this, in the business jungle, there's only one king, and it's called sales. Yes. Yeah. What have mm -hmm. you sold? Uh, we have sold year to date um, four hundred and seventy six thousand dollars. <laughs> wow! Ding, ding. Holy moly! <laughs> I was not expecting that. I no. was not expecting that. No, that is phenomenal. Now we don't know when this was recorded to know, you know, what what the you know when this is and all that. But uh, we can. That's still that's still a phenomenal number, regardless. Well, at the latest, 2019, right? Because they're talking about COVID, so 2019, 2020. It's going to be somewhere in there. Yeah, I mean, this just aired a couple of weeks ago, so so it probably was filmed in 2020, and then you know goes back. All right. So you could potentially. Oh, that was for 2020. Dollars. Okay. Absolutely. We think we'll finish at a million. Yippee! Uh, yokai. So how are you there you go. People finding you. Um, well, first of all, we have had no media or publicity other than the small town she grew up in. Lily, Louisiana, did an article about a small town girl <laughs> invents the better better. We have not paid any influencers. We have done Facebook video ads ourselves. Nita at the corner of the bed. Me. With <laughs> oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. That is awesome. Yeah, we don't need big fancy production companies. Just get it happening. No, yeah, exactly. You need something to get it started. You got to, you know, get. You can't be like, oh no, I need to get, you know, pay three thousand dollars to make a thirty second ad with some, you know, local production companies. You just get your iPhone. Make sure the lighting looks good. Make sure you're you're distributing, you know, distributing the product well in the in the frame, uh, and you're actually telling the story, and you know that you want to tell, and and just do it. Just do and it. in actual fact, 
you know what? It probably stops the scroll a lot better just thinking that it's someone you know rather than a big fancy production that you know someone's going to sell you something. So I love this. It's so yeah. good. Yep, yep, yep. Especially because they get to keep more of that money, you know? Mm -hmm. That's nothing better. Dang, dang. Tell me about you. I was adopted when I was five, so I always knew that um, <laughs> struggles and challenges can over be, be, be overcome. I'll give you an example. When I got divorced, I left with a suitcase and clothes, and that's it. Not a fork, a knife, a spoon, nothing. And immediately I went into debt, and I said, you know what? I sat the kids down, and I said, you know, we can't live like this. We're never going to get ahead if we don't do this. So I said, mm. no more eating out. If we do, it's 99 cents. No more clothes for two years. No more nothing. We're moving into an apartment, and we're going to share rooms, and we're going to do this for two years. And he did, and in two years, we were out of debt. We had a house, and we had money in the bank. My but, God. You know, so well I done. Oh, I love that. You know, it, it li life uh, hands lemons a lot to a lot mm -hmm. of people a lot of times, all of the time. And you you, we, you have to be intentional about what you're going to do to make it, you know, to move the needle and get it, move it in the right direction to where you want to be. And, you know, if, if living, you know, penny to penny is, is, how, is how you want to live, then that is ultimately how you're going to live. But, you know, mm -hmm. if you get intentional about it, make intentional choices and figure out the way that you can, you know, like she said, we, you know, we want to eat out. It's going to be ni the 99 cents menu, mm -hmm. right? Like that's our special, you know, once a week thing or whatever. That's then that's it. That's where the money is going to be saved. That's where we're going to be able to, to make or break us. Yeah, love it. I would like you to tell it five times so every woman who's stuck somewhere and is too mm. afraid to move out kind of feels ashamed of themselves that they can't make that move. Unbelievable. Listen, you guys are terrific. I deal with so many lawyers, and you're the first one I've ever liked. <laughs> I got it in 90 seconds. Bingo, I know what it does, but do I want to be in the bed skirt business? It's not a space I need well, to be You know what, in. let me just say this before... Be guys, I'm out, but not because I don't love you guys. You're, Thank you. You're okay. just a joy. Uh. Guys, let, me, let me help clear things as well. Look, I did an analysis at one point in my career where I spent about an hour a week making my bed. And then I extrapolated that out and figured that's 365 hours a year. Across wow. 10 years, that's months. And so I vowed that I kept my sheets and bedding clean, but I would never make my bed. And for those reasons, I'm out. That That's a... That's our cubes. <laughs> I don't I don't blame okay. you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Trudy and Nita, I want to make the first offer if I might, okay? Okay. I'm going to give you three reasons why you should choose me as a shark, because I imagine you're going to see other offers here today. Uh, number one, I'm going to bring down your cost to $20 if you want to keep it in the United States. That's that, that, oh, like I'm that's saying, right you got to get it about half, right? Half of where you're at now. Your average is $33.50. So, you know, I was saying about $16, but if you can get it down to 20 you got some room to, to wiggle to, you know, to get that price but up there. But it wasn't just the price that she said, it was it, get it down to $20. Twenty dollars and still keep it in, in the, the U.S. In the U.S. and that's important. Yeah, uh, especially yeah. here in the U.S. Is that is, it, is that an important thing in, in Australia? Do, Absolutely. Do they... okay, yeah, Australian good. made. Yep. Awesome. That's awesome. If you're willing to go out, I'll bring it down to eleven dollars. Secondly, I am great at driving public relations. My comfy product that is making sixty-five million dollars. Up. a year after being in business less than three years is making the money predominantly because I am great at creating publicity. And lastly, oh, when you uh. go on, no, one more. <laughs> I always pick the same kind of people. Great people that I could trust, people that love each other. And so you would wind up being very happy in the nucleus family that I put together. I'm going to give you the $150,000 for 20%. Twenty mm. percent is I don't think about my investments if they're less than twenty percent. Honest to God, no matter how nice you are, and you don't even have to answer me right now. I wish I was a son of a bitch who could say you must answer me right now. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm trying to say you should take it from me. But if you want to shop other offers, certainly do that. So, uh, okay. So one thing she said is that she would take it if you, if you were willing to take it out, we could get it down to 11. I could, yeah. you know, I could see you do like a, 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 you know, good, better, best model. 
you get that good model out at 11 you get the the better at, at you know at uh at, at the 20 and then something you know a plus that up from there and and all of a sudden like you you can sell one at you know 40 bucks and still make your make your money on it However, for branding purposes, I probably wouldn't take that because if mm. they can sell it, their um, their retail price sixty three fifty. They've proven with four hundred seventy six thousand dollars of sales that they can make those sales with a good product. I would not do that. I would stick to that better quality product and really make a name for myself. Really get a good brand. So so. Maybe it depends. So they didn't mention anything about any patents, which might be a little difficult uh -huh. to get, but it's something that they should probably invest in because here's the thing. It's a piece of fabric that goes around the bed. And if uh -huh. it can be made in China, it's going to be made in China and someone's going yeah. to sell it in America. So while I, while I agree from a branding perspective, I think to capture that market, you at least, at least have two models, right? A, a, yeah. a, bet, a good and a better um, or better and a best. And, and the better, the best one being made in America, you know, and all that. And then you have the other one that, cause then you can go to retail with it a little bit easier. Cause even at $20, you're going to sell it for like 40 and they're still going to be looking to try to sell it for like close to 80 in the, in like in retail store. I go to like Bed Bath and Beyond or well, if they still exist at this point, uh, Kohl's or somewhere like that, like Th those retail stores are going to be trying to double it, right? And and mm -hmm, in order for mm -hmm. them to do that, you you either got to get it further than twenty down the line, or have have an option where it's like, oh, here's the one that's that's uh, made not made in America. Mm -hmm. And I would say that even put, could push the price of the American made one up further, depending mm -hmm. on uh, where you're at, because it because that would be like forty four bucks. For for you know retail for the China one or you know maybe seventy five bucks or something like that for the for the American made one that maybe has an extra pocket or something on the side. Mm, mm. Gonna do? Well, I, I what I would do is I'd be waiting to find out what else she got because Barbara was nice enough to not you know dig you. Against all odds, not having a lot of money, having a lot of debt. You said, I'm going to take charge of my life. I'm going to fix this. I'm going to be happy because money doesn't buy happiness. That's what a strong woman does. And uh, I love she's She's selling it. She's selling it hard there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. It's very visual. I think this could be a great QVC item. I also think it could be a good infomercial item. So my offer is a little sharkier than Barb's. Oh. I'm going to offer 150000 but for 25%. Yep. And that's because I'm going to have to really get, get down in there and do a lot of work with you. All right. Okay, guys. Here's what I think. I think my other two sharks are uh, brilliant, but, you know, they're, they're, they're just such small thinkers. I mean, all of us are manufacturers, but I've been, I've been doing it the longest. <laughs> so, sounded even harder. <laughs> <laughs> I see this being a commercial product that I take to a whole Asian American hotel owners. They own about 51% oh, of hotels yeah. in the country. And I think that this that on the application. is saving them their staff time. Yep. Uh, it's, yes, yeah, staff and time. And as well as their health. Second of all, I work with Purple, Casper, and Lisa Mattress. I think there's something there. So I will offer you the same $150,000 for 25%. Uh, Thank you. Thank wow. You. Wow. We've got three amazing. That outfits. is, I mean, first of all, just hats off. That's incredible. You, that doesn't happen many times. Uh, but I don't, I don't know. I, I what, what would you do, Sam? Would you be jumping in at 20%? Oh. I mean, have you I, watched enough to know the, the specialties of each of these? Uh, sharks no but i've just guessed it from what you know from what they're talking about i mean definitely laurie and damon have got the you know the ability to grow them quicker um the fact that damon has really thought through that application so quickly i i really like that i i don't know who i'd be going with but what's your thoughts there joe ah uh, you know i i think i think I think Barbara Lori is the ones that are going to walk away with this. Um, and I, I think Lori might get the edge just because she can go right to QVC with it and, yeah, like, exactly. and sell it like, like that. Right. And that's, yeah, yeah. there's a lot of power in that. And not that Barb couldn't do something similar 
and and she has a good rep, you know, reputation of bringing amazing businesses together. They they've shown in past episodes like her, you know, with her going on retreats and stuff with the different business owners that she's in bed with, and it just. I, I, yeah, I think I think Lori's going to be the one that they that that they wind up going with here, mm, mm. and and maybe you know maybe they'll counter first, but we'll see. We'll see. see that mm. no. <laughs> what are you going to do? Um, we we would like to counter because we were hoping not to give up that much. Um, is anyone willing to go to eighteen percent? I'll take that deal. I'll take that deal. Oh, straight oh, up, yeah, totally. take it. <laughs> no, no. No, 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 we both said it, so choose between us. Oh, no Barb, I'm oh. sorry. You got to be a little faster. Who's in the tank? Let me well, there are no more wounds in the tank, but I did take it first. Let me say one thing. Sure, I'll go to 15%. Woo! Oh, oh, my goodness. I, oh. Well, listen, I will just, I don't want to pressure you. Okay. I, I would love to be your partner. You can get money all day long, but I think what's important is the value that comes to you for that money. I was willing to do the 18. Um, I'm good at that. Can you also get the manufacturing cost down oh my for God. us as well? That's all I've done all my whole life. Yeah. Okay. I mean, yep. I've manufactured over a thousand products. I don't get it. Am I missing something? We love you, Barbara. That's always a bad start. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what I love about Barbara. <laughs> uh, yeah, I do. I I do. And I think I think at fifteen percent, I. Uh, but it's still hard for three percent. You're, you're gonna get right. You're gonna go like right to QVC, and and it's mm. it's just gonna you know explode for that's you. That's why I didn't want to start off like that. We love you, Lori. You got a deal. Ah. Oh, <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Congratulations. Congratulations. Love it. See, they couldn't wait to get their hair bands off. <laughs> yeah, right? I guess they didn't like that. Lori can get us on QVC and she can get the manufacturing costs down. And we just think Lori is the right partner for us. Yes. Yes. We love Barbara and Damon. So excited. I don't want to hear from you because you're the winner and I don't like you. But what I do is. You win with you. Try to be cool by letting everybody else get in and make I mean, an I offer. I played too nice. I should yeah. just close the deal. I'm pretty annoyed. No, oh, poor Barbara. Poor Barbara. It happens, right? She know now she knows how Robert feels. Yeah. <laughs> Robert misses out like all the time. And due to overwhelming Shark Tank demand, apparently they are shipping and may you know, there's a delay on their shipping, but their order your their order will be on the way. Uh this is this is awesome. Um Good looking website, you know. It's built on Shopify, apparently. Uh, let's see, what what are their oh shop is all the way to the side here. Uh so $39 or $69. Better uh sleep design economical odds. Oh, they do custom sizes, antique beds, boat mattresses, RVs, and campers. Oh, that sounds great. Oh, there you go. So let's see. If I had a I have a king bed, that's king bed, dollars $59? Okay. Yeah, I mean that's that seems more than reasonable to me. I wonder what the shipping is on that, but uh, but yeah, overall I, I'm I think I'm very uh, very impressed. They get lots of lots of reviews. Well, five oh five reviews. Let's see, they have one negative review. Uh, let's see if that comes up. Purchased this for a king and a queen bed. They are too stretchy to hold anything. Lose all loose all and around the bed. That's what I was worried about. That is wish, exactly what I was worried about. Wish eight could return them. I guess wish I could return them. I don't. Yeah, eight mm. and the I are right next to each other. I might try sewing and trying to make them smaller. Not sure this will even work. Oh, so so they not have a return policy? Uh, wow, they have a lot of instructional videos that they apparently shot. Hey, there's the headbands. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, that's I, you know. Uh, but you know, one negative review uh, that was too loose. You know, maybe maybe they ordered the wrong size. I, I don't, you know, mm. I don't know. But other people seem to think that it, it works. Um, so anyway, Sam, tell the people who you are, what you do, and how they can get in touch with you to do it. Sure. I help people to transform their knowledge and expertise into online educational products so that they've got more time and more money. And you can find me at samanthariley.global. 
Awesome. If you want to get at me, I'm at Super Joe Pardo on all social media. If you want to learn how you can grow your business's profit, go to superjoepardo.com to learn how we can work together. I need you to please, please, please smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm so we can get this video, this information into the hands of more super entrepreneurs like yourself. Get subscribed so you don't miss another Biz Coach Reacts video, and I will see you all in the next video. Take care.